Sunny messaging me uh, last night. How Rops is sleeping. You wanna see how Rops is sleeping? Do you hear what he's listening to? He's listening to this. I'm gonna show you what he's listening to. Rops is sleeping and listening to this, brother. I think uh, good sleep. Good sleep. Welcome on stage. The former DreamHack Masters Malmo Champion and CSGO Legend. Bringing you the trophy for the third edition of DreamHack Masters. Give him a warm welcome. The King of Banana, Freiburg. Wait, wait. Thank you. I have smoke floor. They're all low. I'm re smoking doors. <laughs> I have flash. In a f no, never mind. I'm picking up her. One B, lobby. Kenny S there. Three kills for him, two for MBK. Looking very good in that connected position as well. It was a little a pincer strategy there from SK Gaming. D4 at the very start, holding up for about 30 seconds and getting the drop down control. But MBK ready and waiting with the M4A4. And then Kenny S hitting every single shot required. And it's going to be the first gun round there for G2. SK still have plenty of money to buy here, but good news is for G2 now, like we said, the last round was always going to be difficult for them with no kits. A little utility, but Kenny S did have that orb. Now they have got those kits out. Ready, Nai. ตายครับตายครับตายครับตายครับตายครับตายครับตายครับตายครับตายครับตายครับตายครับตายครับตายครับตายครับตายครับตายครับตายครับตายครับตายครับตายครับตายครับตายครับตายครับตายครับตายคร
Fuck Mary Kill, Jason R. Moe and Hiko. Sorry, Jason, but you're out of here, bro. You're getting offed. Mary Moe, because I think we'd live a life of happiness, to be honest. And bang out Heek so I could hold it over his head for the rest of his life. I think that's good. Hell yeah, Mary Moe. Moe's got money. He's got invest. Dude, me and Mo would make so much money together in our marriage. We'd fucking just own like so much shit and make so much money. And it'd be so much fun. If only we were both gay, man. <laughs> We'd be, yeah, dude. A Jew and an Arab. Okay. 5-3. Нужно забирать этот раунд да. G2 и переводить все это дело на Мираж. Большой шанс закрыть уже вопросы по этой карте. Флешка летит от G2 Apex. Забирает Фера. Слепущий вопрос, так как крота. Холдзер работает против Apex. Она остается очень красной. Курица просто сбивает Повина. Просто выбегает курица. Да, такое тоже бывает, когда концентрация достигает просто своего пика. So far, and even in round three, they had five alive as well. And he... Oh, my God. Can I see that again? <laughs> That's so nicely done. I hate people like that. Like, my deagle. <laughs> <laughs> With the boost, I think he just had to go for one frag there. Like we said, bait in Fallen. If he stays alive with first oranges, then Fallen can find the shots required. This was the key moment there. If Fur just found that first kill, dropped down, it would have been absolutely fine. But he gave G2 an inch and they took a mile. Shocks, he started to see signs of life from him now. Very good clutch and. That's a huge round, but 13-7. Plenty of money still available here for SK. They bring out the double orb setup. G2 still recovering. Get a little for body. Get a default and an execution going. Yeah, throw away that orb. <laughs> yeah, you do that. Yeah. Oh yeah, that was really bad from Navi. Like, he needs to keep composing these moments. So he throws away the orb because he knows he's probably going down here. He doesn't want to give them the chance to recover that weapon. But somehow, Renegades win it, and the money's not great for Na'Vi. Still a chance of overtime here. The wall. When you have a player in this position, you can often leave him, but they're going for a push. They're making a lot of noise as well. Body, he'll enjoy that free kill. Why are they doing that? There's no reason to do that. Yeah, there's not at all. Especially you, don't know who, you don't know where they are. Well, especially when you've just gotten map point. You don't have much money established. And you, you run down like elephants as well? Yeah, you can't afford to be that aggressive just to end the game. Well, it's, it's too late. He's played this one incorrectly. But there's Pasha and Bialy. Pasha now no longer taking the position on the site. And he's going to single-handedly stop this from happening. Even switching over to the USP to grab the final kill. Match point. SK will put themselves on to a pause. But what hope does it have of changing anything? One last gun round. That's what SK's thinking. They have to get on a run now. They have to think of everything they've seen. Likely flashes towards off the banana. Shotzi trying to gain control. Molotov towards the car and the corner. Push any CDs that could be there back. Happy for anyone to be at the sandbags ready. You flash that and then take him down, isolate him. It's Taco now. He knows he needs to get a frag. If he can just find one and pull back, that'd be great. Taco. Goes in immediately. They take cold Zera, but fall in still there with Taco fully blinded. Nearly sprays in to get damage, but not enough. Just hits the shin bone once, and Shank survives. And they'll push on. One gun gone already. Fallen wants to support with the M4, but he's already pushed off the angle. They know where he is. He needs help. He needs someone to bait him back in, and he won't get it. There's no one near enough by as Apex. Quick work follows up. Another round for G2. Another round indeed. Apex looking incredibly sharp. Three kills in this round, make it four. Another headshot for him. Takes down Phelps. Two rounds will do it now for overtime. Orbs coming out once again. Money's starting to stabilize. Not fantastic. You know, it's, and I was like, I don't know. I just, I don't know, man. I always knew I was going to be successful, bro. I always knew I, something was going to happen. I was always stay posi positive. I didn't worry. Like, I, I don't know, man. And it just kind of fell into my lap, bro. I come, me, come, me. Just fell into what my lap. What the fuck is White Box? One more A, one more A. With a deagle. Oh my god. He said one was A. It looked like mid site with a deag. There, there was two B, I think we should take A. Jump, doesn't matter. Finds Kenny anyway. Goes oh. back and nails! Shocks as well! 
fast as ever from Fallen, and suddenly they have the advantage and rotations are on point. They've got good damage into MBK, but it's a double op situation, and they need both kills. Missed shot Fallen, lets oh, them no. in, and MBK changes it once more. Bomb Plant goes to default on the grill. It's all on to Cold Zero. Has a kit, but it's an AWP on a retake. Straight through the smoke. Dear Lord, cold. Aggressive is all. Daniel Spinny, and it's clear that Olaf will not be able to do it. Here, someone is focusing on it. He just goes back to save it. But there, Spinny, he is in the Cobra Adran, which, of course, he will now be cutting. Cutting to... Ku-ku! Ku-ku! Yes, he cut. Come here, my boy. He says Adran and does a minus to Olaf Master. How great! С, вообще с минимальным, сколько там, один-два смока было на команду. Как Гамбит разыграли просто, как они расконтролили. Они, ты видел, вот они были... But yet they fortify A at the exact right time, because that's when Fur and Cold Zero want to go, and through the smoke, Apex is not only rotated, he's made his presence felt already by taking down Fur. Five and four, looking very good now. Apex has been playing like an absolute beast. Three in total, all headshots, of course. And now looking for the fourth. He can't get it, but Kenny S secures the round. But Phelps still fighting back here. He gets yeah, two exactly. kills, but I'm not sure that's going to be enough. Picks up the ball.